We're down to two managers. Has anybody else picked up a gig? Derek Hansen, Pekka Wickman, Jakob Hoistrup. That's that's not anybody letting me know actually what's uh going on here. Um I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I was hoping that was Pekka being like, hey mate, I got a jig. A jig? A gig. A job and a and a gig is a jig, apparently. Let's go find out. As a reminder, we're doing seasons eleven and twelve today. <laughs> Pekka, no. Mateus is still with ATM. Oh, oh, a cheeky two-year extension. Yeah, towards the end of last season, he must have done well, right? Surely he did well if they said it's not just a year extension. It was a two-year. What happened at ATM? Finishing? Oh, they just missed the Copa Libertadores, I think. If it's the... You know, you know, one of those things. Uh, if if the, if the blue is because I think this is the super, and this is the the Libertadores. I think you're probably like rolling your eyes. Let's just look at the rules. Top five. Never mind. Eight through thirteen is Sudamericana. So okay, so that to me makes no sense because then now that's like such a high bar. Oh, I've, I'm sure by now, as you can see, I'm wearing the same shirt as last episode. Um, I'm sure there's people like, no, you've got it backwards. Yes, yes, I did have it backwards, my friends. I'm currently in 16th. Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. 14th. Oh, they just missed out. They just missed out. But they, what, that, I'm so confused now, right? Because, like, didn't make the super... But they gave him a two-year extension. I guess they stayed up. Expected to finish 14th. So right where they're expected to be. I'm, I'm not... <laughs> I'm not understanding why the two... Like... Just just because the managers have been like, you know, one year at a time extensions. I'm curious as to why they did two. That's okay. Interesting. Um, back half of last season. Okay. Starting here. This was a rough stretch. One win and what is that? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight games. Oof. Then another like little hopeful win and then another bad streak but this is a good little run undefeated it's kind of like uh they look like a very up and down team right like i want okay let's go back did that last win 45 no okay they would have had to yeah they were well safe well safe so that's you know good i guess made it to the fifth round oh no no, no we already knew that Okay, there's nothing that happens in the second half of the season. So this season, okay. How are they in the... How are they in the Sudamerica? I thought they didn't make it. <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm so sorry. This is great content. How? You're 14th. Oh, is it one of those things where like... Yeah, the Brazilian Cup. Okay, so 14th makes it. Maybe that's why. Maybe that's why they extended him. Okay, so whoever won the cup, you know, we could look that up, but why would we do that? There's 13 teams that could be <laughs> above them. <laughs> and they get past ALA. Yeah, yeah, my friends, the recently promoted ALA in the fifth round. So now they're in the Brazilian Cup. Oh, they lost to them in the previous season, the fifth fifth round. So can they get past ATP? But maybe the board's just thrilled that they made it to the Copa Sudamericana. Okay, let's see how's that going. Okay, they got past Danubio on a three to one aggregate score line. Nice. And they get is that uh, Fluminense or am I thinking Italian? FLU. There's the badge. I'm sure you know who it is. Does it say? Does it when you talk about? Oh, no, it's not. Why would it even give you a nickname? Come on, boys. Come on. Um, but that, you know, positive. Now, 
is it that they've had two extra games? You really can't say it was fixture congestion, could you? Right? If you look at the first division. I mean, to be fair, this is a, this is a tasty little run in June, and that's a bunch of games, right? So you get your, your draw, and then you go on a nice little run with two wins, three draws, and a loss. I, it seems like a nice little run. It's One loss is, is positive. But really, obviously, the, the meat is down here. So, will the Copa Sudamericana run mess up their first division? Like, or are they going to get bounced out here and then they've got... I mean, look how many games that is. That is that's Irish first division or uh, Irish premier division, I should say, uh, level games. I mean, goodness me. Um, he is 53% win ratio with a 55, 20, and 28 record. Did they bring... Okay, we saw the transfers. Okay, this is... Okay, end of last season after we recorded. 925K. Look at all the players going out. My goodness. Some selling some, some loaning some others. He's a wheeling and dealing. And then over the winter break, which is the, you know, end of season, preseason. 1.7 million, 2.2 million, 2.6 million... Those are the big ones. Those are the big ones. A 6 3 5 in, in, in one start and a sub in your continental competition is exactly what you're going for when you sign a right winger. What about this guy? Vinicius. Four starts on a 6 9 3. Much better. Six foot six. Brazilian. But he was playing in Holland and before that, Portugal. That's inter That's an interesting little ca career trajectory, if you will. I'm not going to look at all of them, but then holy, look at all the business. Two, okay, 15.5 out, 6.5 in. Now, okay, if you can... Okay, maybe it's balancing it from last year. I was going to say, if you could consistently do that, but look at all the lone players. Again, some of you may be like, oh, that oh Fabio's gone. Is that the goalkeeper? No, is that a different Fabio? That's a different one. Can't have two Fabios. Is that is that the rule? Is that the team rule? Is this Fabio still with us? He is. As a backup, it would appear. I guess we could check his stats. Seven league starts. Seven conceded on a 6-7-9 is not outstanding. They must have somebody else. We're not going to look at all of them. But that just seems like a lot of ins and outs. To me. What do you think? I'm so sorry, Jakob. I think you deserve another chance. <laughs> I don't even know what's happening. Spaceman is with Liege Warsaw. He's back in Poland. So did he get sacked? Probably. They probably went down and they still sacked him for it, right? No! What is happening with our managers? He got homesick? How are they doing? Let's go look at and then he gets the claim they win the league. He comes in in March. <sighs> That's funny. Okay, they did go down. Okay, so he left us on March 5th. How are they looking in March 5th? March 5th. After this game. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's so bad. Oh, my. Oh, they had two wins. They had three wins all season. Two wins total under his leadership, not including cups and friendlies and whatever. Oh, that's a very, very bad record. And then they finished pathetic. Like it wasn't like they got I mean maybe you could say there's a new manager bounce, but not I don't I don't really think you can. So I kind of don't blame any 10% win ratio. My goodness. Previous one in 48. I'm, I'm skipping the one that, you know, obviously was there a long time. Short duration. 10% is uh, is pretty bad. 3, 7, and 18. Now, granted, the other managers may have, may have been managing at a different level. But... Nineteen points. Oh. That's that's enough to go to 3, 10, and 25 with a negative 43 goal differential. Okay, 19 points. Let's. I'm, I'm, I'm going to go back to see the worst points total 
to go down from Syria in this experiment. 28, 24, 18. So you're not worst. 27, 26, 23rd, 28, 27, 29, 25. You're second worst. Sorry, mate. So maybe he saw that coming and he was like, there's no way we're going to get to 31 points or wherever it was. You know, like I'm, sh I'm sure they're equally behind. Like I got to get out of here. I'm, I'm bouncing. We'll, we'll see you later. And he goes to Legia of Orsaw, who have won the league except for a blip on the radar here since the 2015-16 season. Goodness me, that is like 13 seasons with one with one dip. He comes in March, was it? March 5th? Comes in after this game. Okay, did they have any league losses? I'm just I'm just curious. Okay, they had one there. They, they'd had some league losses. There's a lot going on, right? Because they're in the, the Euros, or the, the Champions League, and then the Euros. But I think that's a fairly strong finish, right? You get two losses, but you've you've done pretty well for yourself. Um <laughs> wait what i forgot poland already okay the championship group okay okay i was like wait now okay in that in that the championship group started a month after he got there okay so you could say you could say top eight go so they were in the top eight. Looks like decently comfortable. So they've got a month of games. They go to the championship group. And he, I mean, I, I do we say dominate? But like, you're talking about, okay, 17, 11, and 9. And then before that, 12, 10, and 8. 17, 5, 1, and 1. You have 5, 1, and 1 in the championship group. My math is right. Okay, well, let's look at uh, Jagiellonia. 16, 6, and 8. Okay? Okay? 16, 6, and 8. So they went 2, 0, oh, and 5. So that's how they were to go. That, that is unbelievable to make that kind of... I mean, because they were behind. So I was a little harsh. I think you could say, good job coming in. They brought him... Oh, I'm curious why the last manager left. He was sacked because they weren't doing so well because they're used to winning the league, right? That makes sense. So they're they're cruising along and they've got this big drop with the new manager. The previous managers have all left of their own accord, it looked like. And this guy comes in and they're not doing as well, so they sack him and they call up Spaceman. You're like, listen, you've run the Poland national team. You've got Pryor, obviously, in the league with Piast. Can you come rescue us? And then he comes in. They play a, a month of games to get into to, uh, to keep their spot in the championship group, and then from there, they go on and dominate the championship group and win the league. So fair play, fair play. And his contract is good. Yeah, it was essentially a little bit more than a year contract. He gets no bonus for winning the league, but we'll give you nineteen grand if you win the cup. That's what's important to us, lads. So now they're going to have Champions League. We'll have to see how that goes. That's I, I that's interesting. Hey, Chris, thanks for playing. I, 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 I cannot believe Derek. I literally cannot believe Derek Hansen. Okay, my friends, this is how we end up. I'm worried about Derek and Pekka. And Jakob. I, I think they deserve a chance, though. I think Locke's done. I don't think anybody... He's he's made everybody in the Hong Kong League, which is this big, mad. And there's no second division. So, I think Locke, I'm sorry, brother. I think you're done. Let's hop forward a season to the end of year 12. Come on, boys. Let's go. I think this is it for Pekka. Oh, no. Mateus is gone from ATM. Oh, I got the sack, lads. Oh, fairly. I mean, it was the end of the season. Okay, I was like, fairly early, but nope, nope. They made it to the semifinal. 
Wait a minute. They gave him an ex didn't he have a two year contract until twenty thirty? What is the deal there? They finished thirteenth. Sixty-two, twenty-five, and thirty-eight. They sacked him here. So it's not necessarily because of the Suda Americana. Now, okay, we recorded before this game. So the league hadn't gone great. They were kind of on a bad run, you know, like one, two, three, four, five, six games without a win. And then they sacked him, and they kind of got the, you know, a nice little run here, but then a terrible run there. I wonder how close they were to the, like, relegation spots where they felt like they had to make a move. Because they finished 41. It was probably tight. I am stunned. I thought for sure... If they made a run, I mean, that getting to the semifinals, quite the run for the 14th place team, right? Like you finish 14th and you make it into the eight through 13 leg, but you're making, you're, you're essentially obviously two games slash one tie away from the final. And then you sack the guy, man, tough business, this. So after we recorded, they only brought in a loan and a small time player because they already spent all their money. 18 and a quarter going out. Now, a chunk of that was already happening. After the fact, they sold 525, you know, maybe close to 800, 900 grand of players. And then he was gone. It, it didn't matter. And they, oh my, sold 33 million thus far. This isn't, this isn't under his leadership, obviously. That's a whole lot of players leaving. Wow, they flip they flipped that guy to Mexico. Four point nine to eleven and a quarter. That's good business, I guess. Venetius, same thing, was brought in. Flipped two point two to seven. I mean, again, good business, but like, is it gonna cost him? That's what I want to know. Is it gonna cost him? Man, that is a bit of a surprise to me. Not gonna lie. Well, it's been like nine months and he's not picked up another gig sure i mean he's too good not to get another gig right right i think Jakob is in the same boat with pekka i think they're they're rowing down the river of retirement sad spaceman extreme still doing his thing at legend they've extended him 2032 okay does that just happen no bonuses top division relegation wage drop if if you're anywhere near getting like that's never going to happen at least you Warsaw because if you get anywhere near relegation they go axe you right um won the league again and was the head, the head coach of the month for may and april got knocked out in the semifinal that's a bit shocking isn't it um so continued the domination there. Surely he's going to get bored and go somewhere else, right? Right? Okay, last season. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, yeah. The calendar year versus not calendar year is throwing me off. So we recorded before this game. Because it's now 2030. Focus. Champions League against... Oh, no, qualification first against Ferran Cavaros. And got knocked out. Oh, that's harsh. A Hungarian div first division team. Down to the Euros with Kairat. Beat them 7-0 on aggregate. Kazakhstan club. Uh, at, surely there's a rule where the champion... If you lost to somebody in the Champions League, you should be able to have to play them a second time in the Europa League. But they did, and they beat them 5-1. Where was that? You know, where was that? A couple weeks ago, lads. That's what he was asking. Um, and then in the group stage, they had Dundalk from Ireland. Impoli. Or Impoli. Why did I say it like that? Uh, and Sporting. It looks like they did all right. 
I mean, lost a couple games. I guess, can I not see the groups from last season? Please. Prick the points. H, was it? Oh. Fair showing. Dundalk, as expected. Negative 16 gold differential. Zoinks. Um, and then as we saw, they got to the semifinal and lost to Viz Vidzu. Or Vidzev. I can't remember. Um, and then once again, in the champions group stage, one, two, three, four, five, six. Even better, six, zero, oh, and one. So drop, turn the draw into a win. His former club is a bogey club, apparently. He's currently sitting at 64% win ratio, 44, 12, and 12. And not so bad, my friends. Um, did he do in the transfers after we recorded? Yes. A three, 1.7. They spent some money. That's actually spread out over a bunch of players. I'm, I'm not going to look at to see if every single one of them, you know, played. But then kind of balance the books. Again, the money has disappeared at the bottom. I don't know why. Don't know why um two you know winter transfer window goings and three outs but these are loans and then nothing thus far this season so that's what's going on there with spaceman extreme and that's it my friends i'm i'm just skipping straight to this page i'm very confused Locke has had his name changed to rahmani i don't understand because we had the thing where his picture... I wonder if that's that guy's picture. Um, and I went to look at, like, Eastern, where he was a manager for a little bit. And this guy's name is there, not Locke. So Locke has retired. He's disappeared like Ryan and Andrew Clooney. But in retiring, he's also transformed back to his true form, Rahmani. I'm just making sure Derek didn't have a job. I, I didn't check. I think Derek and Pekka are next. And Jakob. I think we're down to essentially Space Maddox Street. So next episode, or um, I guess Mateus, right? Assuming he gets another game. Next episode may be like three seasons. I don't know. Um, let me know if you have an explanation for that right there. I, I don't understand what happened there. Um, I definitely created new players or new managers in the database. I never, I didn't copy any, any former players. So I don't know why it did that, but it's interesting. So hit that like button, leave a comment. We'll see you next time.